Hey, what's up, bros? It's, uh, uh, fucking PewDiePie here, and welcome to a brand new video. I hope your guys' day has been going fantastic. And, you know, I want to start today's video off with a simple question, okay? Have you ever met someone so mysterious, so intelligent, that you were simply baffled? Because last night I was watching some YouTube, it was a little bit late, and I found this kid on YouTube, okay? Now I'm not gonna sit here and be like, Oh yeah, Albert Einstein, you better back up, because this kid is destined for great things, okay? This kid is a genius. Just like I'm not gonna say that this kid is the smartest kid ever to touch the face of this planet. Actually, I take that one back, because I am convinced that this kid will change the world. He's not only the next Albert fucking Einstein. But he's also the next Socrates. And, and and also Donald Trump as well. Just just throwing that out there. Now I know at this point in time we're probably uh getting some non-believers watching this video right now. Probably thinking to themselves, uh, okay, who the fuck is this kid? Next Albert Einstein. Yeah, right, okay. Well allow me, Mr. Calvin here, to shatter all your doubts about this 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 future fucking messiah of science, okay? This intellectual, mysterious Fedora God. Alright? So uh yeah, without further ado, allow me to introduce you to who who I definitely think is gonna be changing the the whole world in its whole, you know, with with definitely some crazy new ideas and uh some scientific uh fucking mindsets and, and all that uh fucking cool shit. You know, uh, Messiah of Science. Messiah of Science, please come out and introduce yourself to these to these uh, falsely guided people. Play the video, dude. Being told to put all of your thoughts into one post never sounds so interesting. Oh God, no! <laughs> it never sounded so interesting. <laughs> And no, I'm not joking. This this kid's a genius, dude. He, he he's just radiating with intelligence and mysteriousness with his with his fucking fedora and shit. <laughs> please, God, no, Sam Pepper, come out and tell me this is a prank. Sam Pepper, where you at, man? Sa <laughs> please. So, here's my thoughts, all put into one single post. I couldn't give two fucks about anybody or anything on this planet. And the reason for that is I find everybody's intellectual intelligence far less superior than that of my own. <laughs> Dude, this, this has to be a joke. You can comment on this and say whatever you want. I won't care. And nor will I comment back on the feed. I love how this guy is going on about I don't care. It doesn't matter what you say. I don't care. You you know what? Why don't you comment right now? I don't give a shit. Go comment right now. I'm not going to reply to it because I don't care. Dude, when you make a video, try to let everyone know that you don't care. You care. Okay, let's just get that straight. You do care. Say whatever you want. I won't care. And nor will I comment back on the feed. Just know this. The zombie apocalypse happens. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> if the zombie apocalypse does happen, <laughs> what? <laughs> well, I mean, today I learned that the zombie apocalypse is a possibility because uh, Fedora Kid definitely, I mean, he, if, he wouldn't be talking about it if it wasn't a possibility, am I right? Right, guys? Right? If you all become zombies, don't think I will not hesitate to kill you. Because as soon as I kill you while you're zombies, I will take your bodies and make a house out of them. <laughs> what? Dude, this guy is fucking crazy. He's just like trying to think of any excuse to talk about killing someone. He's just like, if the zombie apocalypse were to happen, I would kill you and I would probably uh, crucify your body and, and build a triangle around my house to propel the demon spirits. I mean, this is only if the if the zombie apocalypse were to happen, but I mean, if it were to happen, I would definitely kill you and smear your blood across my face just to show these zombies that I, I'm the second coming of Braveheart. And paint it with your very blood. I will not care. I actually look forward to a zombie apocalypse myself. 
you guys smell that? That smells like bullshit. You know, this reminds me of this kid back in high school that used to always listen to screamo music and he dyed his hair like red and shit. And he used to always talk about, oh yeah, when the zombie apocalypse comes, that's the day that shit will get real. And everyone would always be like, uh, buddy, I don't think zombies are real. And he would be like, no. There was a very likelihood chance that a virus could contain some sort of some sort of DNA DNA bullshit that will they'll fucking uh, zombies yeah they they walk around you bite yeah the virus spreads we're all zombies okay very likely and I remember one time I think in like tenth grade I got in a huge ass argument with this kid because I said that basically that zombies taking over would be like the U S military getting completely destroyed by a small little African tribe in the middle of fucking Nigeria. If a zombie apocalypse happens, one of two things I'm doing is either A, going around and surviving, possibly killing off people that just got bit, maybe people that aren't even bitten. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? He's just gonna fucking shoot random people? Like, I love the escalation of that. He's just like, oh yeah, definitely. I'm just gonna try to survive. Uh, maybe kill some zombies. Uh, maybe try to shoot some people that have just freshly been bitten. And yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna fucking kill everybody. I will not care. I will not hesitate. You will die over and over again. I will make sure of that myself. I will not hesitate. I will not care. And did, did, did I mention that I won't care? Okay, just, I, I don't care. I will kill you. I will kill you again. I, I won't, I won't care. Did, did, did I say that already? Okay, okay. I'll, I'll kill you again. Wait, wait, I don't care. I just, do you know that? The zombie apocalypse, I welcome you. Gives me a reason to do the perfect murder. Kill somebody who isn't infected and say that they were infected. They'll believe it too. Ta -ta. Okay, well then. Well, in conclusion, guys, this guy literally wants to fucking murder someone. I mean, that's seriously what it is. He's just like, I really want a zombie apocalypse so I can just straight up fucking murder people and be like, yo, there's zombies. What are you going to do then, huh? Uh, hey, you can't prove it, huh? Huh? You, you want to die, bitch? I'll, I'll, I'll be like, you're a zombie too. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video today. And if you did, it's your lucky day because for every person that likes this video, this isn't a scam, by the way, you will be receiving a million dollars and a free Lamborghini and a free private jet that's right dude we're doing the the fucking combo package just this isn't a scam I mean this is completely legit what dude it, it's completely real this is not a scam at all jokes aside I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video today and thanks for watching peace peace guys just to let you all know I don't care at all um if you if you like the video or not I mean I, I don't care I don't um I really don't I, I do I do girls living in this fucking mad world with no fear for the tears of fear niggas here they revere when I'm coming back oh sweatshirt yes sir this is life and it gets worse but you always come back from the depths care and if somebody want to hold me back I'm gonna eat him like Lester let's work because I'm coming with the fear of God not trying to be something that is clear I'm not I'm just trying to get the whole world with their hands up like I'm summoning in the spirit bomb and it feels so good nigga.